Today we are going to show you the best solar generators you can buy right now. We have analyzed the market and listed these 5 best solar generators for you. For more amazing tech product reviews and suggestions please subscribe to our channel. We will try our best to present you with the best tech products that you can buy now. Products links in the description box. In this video, we'll be covering solar generators, including what they are, why you may want to choose them, and some of the best options out there. Number 5 EcoFlow River 2 Pro The EcoFlow River 2 Pro is a portable power station that stands out from many others due to its compact size of 10.6 inches by 10.2 inches by 8.9 inches and weight of only 17.2 pounds. This makes it easier to carry around and store, without compromising on its performance and functionality. It has a 768WH battery capacity, which is smaller than some other power stations, but still enough to recharge a smartphone over 30 times, a laptop up to 5 times, or power a lamp for up to 30 hours. Additionally, the River 2 Pro offers a high power output of 800W and can handle a surge of up to 1,600W, making it capable of running 80% of household appliances, such as a mini-fridge, LCD TV, fan, or Wi-Fi router. The device has multiple charging ports, including four 120V AC outlets, 112V DC vehicle charging port, two 12V barrel style ports, three 2.4 amp USB-A ports, and a bidirectional 100W USB-C PD port, which allows for charging up to 11 devices simultaneously. The River 2 Pro can be recharged in various ways, such as plugging it into a wall outlet at home, a 12V DC port in a vehicle, or a solar panel while in the field. It can even accept a charge from its bi-directional USB-C port, although this method is somewhat slower than the other options. When tested with a 200W panel on a bright sunny day, the battery went from empty to full in about 5 hours. However, this duration may vary due to cloud cover, shade and shadows, and the movement of the sun. Number 4 The Anchor 767 Portable Solar Generator is a heavy product, weighing 30.5 kg 67 pounds. However, considering its capacity, the weight is not surprising. Anchor has added wheels to address the weight issue, making it easy to move around on various surfaces. It also has well-placed handles for easy lifting. Despite being heavy, it's fairly compact, 20.5 by 15.5 by 10 inches, making it easy to transport in a van or camper and use around the house, shop, or garage. The generator has 12 ports, 4 AC, 1 TT, 30, 2 car ports, 3 USB-C, 2 USB, and it lasted for several days after heavy use, including powering dual monitors, air fryer, blender, and charging small electronics, with a digital display showing input, output, the remaining battery percentage, how many more days it will last at the current output, and what ports are being used. This display feature is pretty standard across other power banks on the market, but the ability to control the power station remotely via the Anchor app is impressive. What sets the Anchor 767 generator apart from competitors' products is that it charges entirely in about 2 hours, with Anchor claiming that it charges from 0 to 80% in 1.4 hours and 0 to 100% in 2.5 hours. In testing, it reached 80% in 1 hour and 25 minutes and 100% in an hour and a half, in line with the advertised charging time. Compared to the 8 hours it takes to charge a 20,000 mAh power bank fully, the Anchor generator's charging efficiency is impressive. Under normal circumstances, the generator can last for days or even weeks at a time between charges, making it an excellent choice for powering small electronics, a 12V refrigerator, or kitchen appliances. Additionally, Anchor solar panels can be purchased to go with it, which can extend the generator's battery life even longer. Number 3 The Bluetti AC200 Max keeps the same look and feel as its predecessor. The rugged plastic case has dark tones with the Bluetti logo on the front. It measures 42 cm x 28 cm x 38.7 cm and weighs 28.1 kg. Two handles located on each side allow moving the unit safely while two fans also on each side help to cool it down. The AC200 Max comes with a big 500W block adapter and a plastic bag containing cables for car and solar charging. The AC200 Max is one of the few power stations that has a full-color touchscreen. The crisp display gives information about the station's charge and discharge activities. The hierarchical menu is well organized, offering easy access to settings, battery data logs, and any alarm that may have been triggered. The screen backlight is kept on for 30 seconds before turning off. A beep that can be disabled is sounded on any screen press. 5 AC outlets are available on the front panel and can output a maximum of 2200W. 
A single-phase NEMA TT-30 socket is provided to power RV appliances. For high current 12V ports are included. 2DC5521 for charging cameras or RC cars with a combined power of 120W, 1120W cigarette lighter, and 1360W output for various low-voltage appliances such as a small fridge. Bluetti is generous with the number of USB sockets which consists of three groups covering different output currents. A unique 100W Type-C port capable of powering devices such as gaming laptops. 236W and 215W Type-A sockets are also present to charge smaller devices such as older phones or tablets. The AC200 Max has two wireless charge surfaces on the top capable of 15W each. Input sockets are present on the left side of the AC200 Max and include two battery extension ports, one 900W-145V DC port for solar charging, and one 500W-58.8V DC input to charge from the grid via the AC block adapter. The fastest way to charge is with a combination of DC and AC sources which bring a full charge to just over 5 hours. As with other Bluetti products, rubber sleeves cover all output sockets while input sockets are protected by plastic caps. Number 2 Jackery Explorer 1000 I recently used the Jackery Explorer 1000 portable power station with the Solar Saga 100 solar panels. You can opt to buy the two together as the Jackery Solar Generator 1000 or purchase them separately and use them together. Whether you're going on an overland trip and need to power your fridge, or working remotely in your van, the Jackery Explorer 1000 portable power station is a reliable and helpful source of power. The Solar Saga 100 solar panels are a nice bonus and worth the investment. If you're only planning on charging small electronics and laptops, the smaller Jackery 500 may suffice. Especially if you have solar panels and can charge up in the sun. The smaller model is also about 10 pounds lighter. However, the larger battery is useful for power outages at home. It's reassuring to know that you can still power essential items during a blackout, especially if you live in an area where storms often cause power outages. The solar panels are easy to store and have a max efficiency of 23.7%, which is better than other brands. They respond well to sunlight, but even a small shadow can affect the input. The fold-out kickstands make it easy to adjust the panels to face the sun. When traveling by car to your camping destination, you can charge the power station while you drive. This is a convenient alternative to remembering to charge it before you leave. The recharge times listed are for getting the battery to 80%, so keep that in mind. During my lakeside camping trip, I was able to power all my modern amenities with the Jackery Explorer 1000. It's almost completely silent, so I didn't even notice it once it was set up. We were able to charge devices easily and even connect small appliances that weren't battery powered. I even worked remotely for a day with my laptop plugged in. When it was time to pack up, the model's weight of 22 pounds felt solid but manageable thanks to the carrying handle. The power station has several output sources, including three AC outlets, two USB-CS, two USBs, and one DC car port, so it can power almost anything that needs to be plugged in. The solar panels also have a USB-C output port and a USB-A output port, so you can connect devices directly to them if needed. Number 1 EcoFlow Delta 2 We reviewed the EcoFlow Delta 2 Max Power Station, which has a unique design as there are no buttons or a screen on the front of the device. All ports and buttons are located at either end of the device, with two additional ports at the back for connecting extra batteries. Although it does not have an integrated torch slash light, the LED screen is bright enough to see in the dark or bright sunlight. The buttons and ports are all sunken to minimize the risk of damage during transportation, and the power station comes with three cables, an AC, a car lighter, and a DC5521 to DC5525 cable. When we received the power station, it had a 30% charge, and we charged it from the mains with a 13-amp plug. It took 40 minutes to reach 80% charge, which is slightly slower than the specifications claim, but still very fast. A full charge can be achieved in just 43 minutes when the combined solar and AC input is 2400W. According to EcoFlow, the Delta 2 Max can charge a camera battery 99 times, a drone 39 times, and a laptop 26 times. Although we have not tested these exact numbers, we can confirm that the power station holds its charge very well. Setting up the app was straightforward, and it found the power station immediately. The app allows you to customize all settings, from changing the screen timeout level to upgrading the firmware. The app is stable and accurate, with data that matches that on the LED screen. The fans on the power station are loud when the device is charging or working hard with multiple devices plugged in, but they are quieter than previous models we've tested. 
The warm air being dispelled from the unit is reassuring as it helps prevent thermal buildup, which can be a potential problem for power stations like this. Finally, the EcoFlow Delta 2 Max can be expanded with two extra batteries, and there is an optional upgrade called the Power Stream Balcony System, which allows surplus energy generated from solar panels to be fed back into your house to cut your energy bills and reduce energy waste. All of the best solar generators are on our list. Please click the thumbs up icon if you found this video to be helpful. Which solar generators would you choose? Let us know what you think by leaving a remark below. Thank you for your time click the like button and subscribe to the channel. If you found this video to be useful in any way so you won't miss any upcoming updates. All of you who viewed before that I hope to see you in the upcoming video.